Good morning, everybody. We're getting the slow cooker ready for a pork roast that we're gonna cook in here all day for supper tonight. We're gonna have pulled pork sandwiches. It is still pretty early in the morning. I had a grocery delivery order come before school even started this morning. I think, I don't know, I might have to trim some of this uh, if it's too big to fit in here. We'll see. Oh yeah, we're good. I should have ordered some apple juice. I love to put apple juice in here whenever I'm making pulled pork, but I didn't think about it when I was putting the order in last night. Let's see what we've got here. I'm looking for the little, I forget what it's called, but the, uh, it's a sweet cherry rub, I think. Oh, there it is, touch of cherry. Barbecue rub, we got this from Lowe's. We're just gonna put a lot of this on here, and I'm gonna put a little bit of smoked paprika. And I'll add some water since I don't have any apple juice. We'll just put a little bit of water. I love using a slow cooker, especially when school starts back. I'm gonna go with eight hours. I think I'll do, let's see. Yeah, eight hours on low. chores once again. Today we're going to clean this shelf up and organize it, sweep, and mop in here. It's going to be a slop mop too y'all. Okay. In the O-Cedar spin mop bucket we have hot soapy water. I've got some Mr. Clean in there with hot water. We're just going to pour it on the floor. We're gonna use this Lidman New and Improved Nitty Gritty Roller Mop. And we're gonna scrub this floor. Then we'll get the O Cedar Mop and go back over it. This is gonna scrub all the dirt out of the grout and everything.
Cheetos and Daddy. Oh my goodness. Two big muscles on that boat. Man, you kind of look like a muscle man. Tyus got home just in time for the afternoon cleanup. Okay, y'all, we've got 52 minutes left on the slow cooker. We're gonna make a three cheese, macaroni and cheese to go with this. And then we're just gonna have some chips and applesauce. We like chips and applesauce with any time we make pulled pork and stuff. So we're gonna have that and salad. But I had half a box of shells from the last time we made whatever it was we made with shells. And I'm gonna use those up and make a little macaroni and cheese. It's that time of year to start clearing out the cabinets, making room for all the holiday baking that will begin. So we have medium cheddar, shredded mozzarella, also getting rid of some of the cheese I had, and shredded Parmesan. I think we're gonna put some crackers on top. It's gonna be like a little macaroni and cheese bake. We're gonna cook the shells in here first. This is smelling good over here in the slow cooker, y'all. Oh, I got the Kinder's Hot Honey barbecue sauce. This is my favorite. This, to me, tastes very close to one of the barbecue houses we have around here. It's very close to their barbecue sauce, not rib country. Um, I can't think of their name. We have a lot of barbecue places, but it's really good. We also have the hickory and brown sugar, I think, of the Kinders. So far, all of these sauces that we've tried are great, and the seasonings. Founded in 1946. My mama was born in 1944. All right, the shells are done. We're gonna put in some butter. And the cheeses, I'm gonna put in the rest of this mozzarella, shredded Parmesan, and cheddar. I'm gonna put a little more cheddar. We're gonna put one egg. While Sissy's getting that ready, I'm putting in a little splash of milk. We'll mix all of this together. I still feel like we need a little more cheddar in here. It's not quite cheesy enough. Okay, we're going to put some salt and pepper. Now we'll spray this 8x8 eight eight casserole dish. Oh, I also found some mashed potatoes in the refrigerator. We got these from Ingalls a couple of weeks ago, but the date on them, it's still good. 9.15, so we're going to warm these up. This is a barbecue sandwich slash clear out the refrigerator's night. <laughs> We're crumbling up the crackers on top. We have some melted butter. We're gonna drizzle that over and it's going in the oven for 25 minutes. Yeah, very good. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna put a little more of this cheese on top too here. Okay, macaroni and cheese is done. I've got the mashed potatoes in the microwave. I'm gonna put the salad in here. I also have some of this bean soup left over from last night, which tonight is pretty much like beans with some carrots and onions in it because you know it gets thicker overnight. I'm gonna warm this up too in case anybody wants that. story to not Manny? Yeah. Which one is this one? The Bernstein Bert one. Gonna ready for bed. Where's Mama? Where is Mama Bear? There's Mama. And Daddy. And Papa. <laughs> and Papa. Mama and Papa Bear. It's evening in the Bear family's treehouse. Brother, sister, and Honey Bear are playing. Nope. What are they playing? Hide and seek. There she is. There's Sister Bear. Now where's the other one? Hmm. Up here. There she is. There she is. Now the cubs are ready for bed. Sister finds her teddy bear. Good night, you dears, nervous. Mama and Papa say. Yeah. What about our good night kisses, say the cubs? How could we forget? 
Mama and Papa kiss each cub before turning off the lights. How do they turn off the lights? Oh, we don't see the switch on here, do we? Oh, there it is. Lights out. Good night.